Hey everybody, this is Rido, and we are back to Lego The Hobbit. Let us continue the story. The company cleared their camp and continued on their journey. Stories from the night before lingering in Bilbo's mind. They embarked for the last bridge towards the valley of the Troll Shores. So here we go. How many guys are there? Five. Group of five. I guess at certain points in the Lego The Lord of the Rings you would have larger groups too. But usually not. Is there something I need to do to talk to this guy? No, he's just standing there it seems like. Weird. Where are we on the map? Well, we've not really made it very far. <laughs> But in another thought, we kind of have made it kind of far. I'm a little worried about how short this game is going to be. Uh, just for the story. The, they had like 16 levels in LEGO Lord of the Rings. Let's see, let's get to the guy with the hammer. I wouldn't be surprised if it was down to like 9. Well, we're up to 4 now. Not knowing anything uh, about the story leaves that just as a big question mark in my head. I don't know if we're going to fight Smog in this level or if we're going to fight Smog in 25 levels from now. What's he want? If you were planning on crossing into Troll Shores, I'm afraid I have to disappoint you. I came out to fix the bridge, but I threw my back out as soon as I lifted the first piece. It's rather embarrassing, to be honest. <laughs> if you're in a desperate hurry, you could always attempt to build it yourself. So, I think we can probably build it ourselves. I think we have enough items, if I was to guess. Uh, nope. And we can't just cross the river. Interesting. So I traded all those rocks, didn't I? I traded them and now here comes my com comeuppance. I needed them. Well, I won't be doing any more trades. Uh, obviously, you shouldn't until later in the story, or when you're done playing the story. You can't do anything with that. Why would they have that trade sit there? I'm getting the wood and the rope. Fine. But I don't think I'm... I'm getting any rocks. Hmm. This is a strange it's a problem to be in. A game... A LEGO games have never had this problem before, so... Weather top. What am I doing in this area? Why am I here? Why does this area exist? Hmm. I would need somebody with the ability to... to grow plants. I probably need somebody with the ability to break that. None of these rocks are giving me rocks. <coughs> hmm. Buddy up. Hmm. What's this one say? 
Use a slingshot to hit that. Hmm. That's like 19. Do we need 20 of those? They're, they're kind of... <laughs> kind of too much there. Do you have a slingshot ability? I cannot believe the game let me trade when I needed that thing to move forward in the game. That seems so ridiculous. Well, obviously I can't get any more here, so let's get out of this section. wandering far off the path for a silly reason. The game did this to me. Uh, I'm not willing to take full responsibility even though I made the decision to trade. The truth is they put the man who wanted to trade right in front of me as I was walking. Why are there so many doors going into areas? Hmm. And why are there so many... Like, feel like puzzles... Going on here? Are these spikes gonna go down again? Even if they did go down... What are they gonna do to change anything? Oops. Like you step on the switch and then one let us assume you run over here and step on this switch. And then in here we get this, which is a crank for this. And then we push this. extends platforms and the, there's one mithril brick and that seems to be the only thing in this area well, it seems like a little bit too much work was put into that And it also seems like there's a cave pretty much everywhere. <laughs> Is this the final one we needed? We're up, we're up to 20, so let's hope. <sighs> what if I had somehow found a way to spend even more, or just not collect that much? It seems rather ridiculous. No, he wants 25. And I can't turn in anything else. Can't trade. I need five more of those. Let's find the guy with the hammer. In the hopes that hammering rocks may produce more of those. It seems like it might. See, I only need one more now. Yeah, Alright, 27, so... Just had to figure that out myself, obviously, the, that the hammering of rocks would produce more rocks than hitting them in it with a sword. Hmm. Now, is it better to have these, these sections in the game or in the... Uh, open world or the 
the levels. That's what I meant to say. Would you prefer it to be in the open world or the levels? Hmm. I think you can mix it both ways. I, I don't think it really changes too much either way. Uh, I think when all is said and done, building more Legos works fine. Now, I, I can see from this scale here, there's a little bit of an issue where at even the 1080p resolution, what it's showing me is taking up half the screen. That's kind of low. Hmm. I I would try to redo this if I if I were them. The concept's good. The the, the way it's being depicted is not so much. Uh, you made that look like child's play. Now I feel even more embarrassed. But that's not important. What matters is you've restored the path into Trollshaws. Here, I was paid in advance. But since you did all the work, I think it's only fair you take this. Have to wonder if he was paid two mithril bricks and he just kept one. The company took shelter for the night in the desert. That was eleven minutes farm. before we started the level. I, his farm was deserted, seemingly in great haste, proved a mystery. However, it was certainly Good no looking small owl. thing that destroyed the farmhouse. As a good animated Lego Come owl. For the night. I think it would be wiser to move on. We could make for the Hidden Valley. I will not go near that place. We have a map. If we cannot read, Lord Elrond could help us. I do not need their advice. It's so funny, right. they're and fighting. I've had enough of dwarves for one day. Is he coming back? the matter? Trolls. Trolls taking a horse or two. He's got Myrtle and Minty. I think they're going to eat them. We have to do something. As our official burglar, we thought you might like to look into it. I'm not afraid. I'm up for it. Are you sure this is a good idea? No. It's perfectly safe. We'll be right behind you. <laughs> What are they having him do? So we're sneaking here. I assume we're not gonna alert alert him if we start to break some stuff. Who's that? So it's I have to play as this guy. Hmm. So we have a sneaking level. Earlier in the game, and we can't. Uh, not earlier in this game, but in the Lord of the Rings game. Seems like we could smash things here, fine. But we are in a sneaking mode, so it would take a little bit longer. I think I'd prefer to leave everything in just for free play mode. Just move forward with, with the story. This guy's the fisherman. Fisherman. First fishing minigame. 
exactly the same as Lego Lord of the Rings, not surprising. I, I'm really surprised I didn't make the Hobbit first and then the Lord of the Rings game. I, I would assume that would probably work better. Let's see. So what am I supposed to throw this? that way interesting so we have a problem with them eating horses we don't have a problem with them eating crabs I guess I don't the hobbit seems to love to eat fish and seafood Get all these collectibles as well we can. We're getting guided quite well by these stones. Uh, considering we're up to like the fourth. What does that say? A key is needed. Oh no, a slingshot is needed because it's a triangular target? Oh, because there's a bag under it. That's that's a cool way to make the, a very similar thing different for two different characters. <laughs> hmm. So one horse ran away, now we need to go free the other horses. Who puts horses in different gates? Hmm. I'm surprised the trolls are so communicative. Uh, I would have assumed trolls wouldn't have that much language skills hmm. We're looking through all the characters to see if any of them have a flail nope none of them do so that must be a free play section thing again the game put that right in front of my face like it was some supposed to be something shovel who has a shovel that guy, apparently. So, we're starting down kind of the slow path of figuring out which character has which ability. Eventually we'll find, or well, at least in most LEGO games, you find one character has 90% of all the abilities anyways. So now we throw in a mushroom. Is that what that is? It's a little strange you have to hit this thing three times too. That's certainly new. Hmm. Seems like you can't really speed up that process very much either. You have to get hit it, then wait for it to fall in the basket, then take aim again, then hit it, then wait again. Mm. Mutton is made from sheep. If they're eating mutton, they're eating sheep. <laughs> so he's stealing a troll's knife? <laughs> Blimey! It's got arms and legs and everything! What is it? I'm a burger. Uh, pop it! Burglar of it? Can we cook him? We can try! No! 
Drop him! You what? I said, drop him. Well, he did what he said. Wow, how many people are on screen right now? Quite a few. Are we going for a buddy fight or? What are we trying to do here? Well, the buddy attack didn't work. He's picking up rocks, he's throwing them at me. I'm running around and smashing things. The game's not giving me as much direction as it probably should. Fire that. Launch something at him. And we did a double attack. Hit those buttons. Looking for the prompt. It's odd the game's making a, a sound every time I hit it. There we go, knock the bees in around them. Buddy attack ready and do another one. Lay down your arms, or we'll whip his off. Mm. I still don't like the buddy attacks, so I think it, it was a concept that should have been dropped. Here's an interesting moment too: is they're afraid of his arms getting ripped off, but since they're Lego characters, I've seen plenty of gags where arms have gotten ripped off and just put back on and they didn't care at all. Don't bother cooking him. Let's just sit on him and squash him in his jelly. I should be so tired and grilled with that sprint rope side. Wait! You are making a terrible mistake. I meant with the, uh, with the, with the seasoning. What do you know about cooking dwarves? Shut up. Hmm. Let the, uh, Flurgeburger Hobbit talk. Uh, the, the secret to cooking dwarf is, um... <laughs> yeah, yes. Yes. <laughs> the secret is... To skin them first. <laughs> what a load of rubbish. I've been plenty with their skins on. What was he even thinking? Telling him to skin him first. Them there, I all have have parasites. Let them all go. Well, I don't know what you're up to. This little spirit is taking us for fools. Is 
seems like the wrong time to take a moment and build something. Oh no! Really? Oh wow! This game has messed me up so much. And they had to have thought this through, didn't they? Oh yeah, they thought it through. I'm gonna have to break this box, get three things to get up to 15. Just barely have enough, wow. So what are we building this time? I don't know yet. This and then this. Seems like we're making some kind of cannon. This, this, and the leaf on it. Little accent piece there. Yeah, th this looks like the game Mousetrap. There. And there. See, the pieces aren't, like, in a relative size to each other. I think that's kind of part of the problem here, I, I would say. Is that it's just a lack of relative difference there. Maybe that's a good thing, maybe that's a bad thing. Definitely feels odd though. Some of those pieces are way bigger than the others. The dawn will take you all. So now what do I do? Break the rocks. With the B attack. And apparently trolls get turned into stone? When did that happen? What kind of troll gets turned into stone? By sunlight. As weird. As a weird resolution to that problem. Well, that's another level down. We we had a lot in our uh, way there just because we traded those extra collectibles. I'll never do that again until I'm done with the storyline, obviously. Uh, it took us 28 minutes to get this far because we had to take an extra 13 minutes running around collecting stone. We've got a growingly massive amount of events to deal with that that will give us probably I would guess at least three extra hours in the free play uh, overworld uh, style gameplay when we get to that but we still gotta get to the story first anywho that's it for this recording as always I ask you to like share subscribe Comment if you want to and watch every second of my videos. All of that helps out. If you want to support me, you can click on my name, Rido. On the right will be a blue button that says support this channel. Click it, make a donation. And if you want to friend or follow me on basically any social media sites, there's a whole bunch of links down below. Thank you for watching. Have a good evening.